it's officially moving day. Can you guys guess where I am headed to? video we are in DC I just finished unpacking um, my suitcases here and I'm actually about to eat now I got some Chipotle it is waiting it is ready to be eaten um, but yeah this is DC watching some YouTube, 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 and my hair is a mess, please, it's getting washed tomorrow, tomorrow's not my usual wash day, but we're gonna wash it tomorrow to prepare for work, and if I didn't tell you guys before, so I'm in DC for work reasons, and that's why it's like a three month type of thing, but that that is that, I'm about to start reading or finish reading this book this is a very quick book to read very quick read or it should be a quick read but you know i can never just read consistently i have to take breaks give myself a little mental break i'm about to find something else to watch on youtube to keep in the background while i read like i said my face is very oily well it's not oily it just has um, aquifer on it. I use it as like a thing to protect my skin barrier so it doesn't get dry out. My skin is very dry right now and I need all the moisture to stay in. We're in a different state, different climate. We gotta protect it. <laughs>
Saturday. No, it's Sunday. Sunday, March, April, May. <laughs> Sunday, May, May 14th. It is 12 something, 12.53. Could not see that. Um, I just showered and washed my hair. I'm gonna go ahead and wax my armpits and then I have a video to edit. So I'm gonna go ahead and edit that and that's it pretty much for today. And then I have to cook or meet Oh I just poked my eye out. Ooh. I have to meal prep for lunch this week. To bring with me to work so yeah that is gonna be the day for today probably gonna stay and just watch tv show and movies and youtube food is here okay that's it today hopefully they gave a lot of food the price this has to be a lot of food right decent amount compared to what I usually get in Florida. It's gotten really stingy. I'm gonna watch some TV while I eat. Bye! So it is 8.17. Still why do I keep showing you guys that you can't see it? It's 817. Believe me. I'm gonna go ahead and cook, even though, even though I realize that I realize that I don't have any Tupperware. Like there's no Tupperware here for me to bring food to work. So I'm gonna go ahead and cook. Anyways, I'm probably not going to eat dinner. I'm still full for lunch. I'll probably eat a snack or something. But I'm going to go ahead and cook. And then I'll um, just have... Wait, I don't have anything to put that food in. So I can't cook. I can't cook anything. So... That was a bust, that was a fail, and I'll see you guys in the next clip. I'm going to go ahead and start cooking um, my lunch for next week. I spent way too much money this week on groceries, or yes, this week, because I've really only been here for a week, and I've spent way too much money, so we're going to have to really back in next week. I'm going to make something that I usually make, it's just pretty simple. And easy, nothing crazy.
crazy. I'm not trying anything new right now. You feel me? I just have to make sure we have a baking tin. So there's like a couple bacon tins, but um, mm, I wish I had bought some foil. These aren't mine, so you can understand my cause for concern. But I think so. I want this to make for dinner for next week, and then this is going to be for lunch. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this. figure out yeah this is gonna take a while because I have to cook there's only one tin so I'm gonna have to cook them separately what I need to cook for tomorrow there's five individual pieces I need five days worth of food so it's gonna be like a breaded chicken the restaurant it's maybe two dollars you know what I'm saying 365 for some fries but if I were to go buy it it would have been dollars and change it just doesn't make any sense to me it's actually very annoying. and that's also another reason why despite the fact I don't know if I mentioned this before but I'm having my car shipped here and despite the fact that it is a lot of money. It's not cheap, that's for sure. I'm still doing it because at the end of the day, I need my vehicle. I need to be able to move what I want because in instances like this, but like I said, I didn't feel like cooking food, but I would just want something light. But with these apps, you have to order like a buku amount of food or it has to come up to a certain amount of price before you can even like see the worth of you ordering online. And I'm just like, I'm not doing that. So if I had my vehicle, I'd just get in my car and go buy something. Especially for instances where I don't have any food in the house and I just want something quick, then I can just easily pick up and get in my car and go buy something real quick. So in the end, I feel like having my car will save me money because if I'm like, feeling really really lazy to where I don't want to take the bus to go get food then I'm gonna order food I'm gonna bitch about the fact that it costs me an arm and a leg but I'm gonna order it oh you know what oh shit I'm not doing this right I need to melt some butter first So I melted the butter, alright, as melted as it needs to be, and I'm going to pour the breadcrumbs in here. I usually get the plain breadcrumbs, but because I don't have that much seasoning here, I wanted something that could give this a little bit more flavor, and hopefully this is enough for... Um, I'm hoping this lasts me at least, at least the entire time I'm here. So three months at least. 
so I'm gonna have to make sure I'm switching up my meals. Fixing this. Okay. Let me take some. from the chicken so I'm gonna clean that out when it's finished and then we're gonna do the potatoes but in the meantime I'm gonna eat 